London has some amazing museums, and most are amazingly free, but one that should definitely not be missed is the British Museum. Dedicated to human history and art, the museum first opened to the public in 1759. Over the past two and a half centuries, the museum has expanded to what we see now, a massive collection of over eight million objects from all around the world. Admission is free, but donations are welcome. Opened in the year 2000, the Queen Elizabeth II Great Court is the largest covered public square in Europe. 3,312 pieces of glass make up the ceiling, and no two panes are the same. Among the museum's greatest artifacts is the Rosetta Stone. Discovered in 1799 by Napoleon's army, the Rosetta Stone unlocked the language of the ancient Egyptian hieroglyphs. Ancient cultures from all over the world have their place here. In this room, we see ancient stone panels from Nineveh that date back to 700 BC. We see a variety of activities being displayed in the etchings from daily life, everything from transportation to battle scenes. As we continue our tour, we see Greek and Roman sculptures, along with other antiquities from ancient times. There are several sculptures from the Parthenon, the ancient temple dedicated to the goddess Athena. Made from white marble as a show of Greece's power and wealth, these statues and wall carvings once decorated the outside of the Acropolis. Some statues, like these, are original, and some are recreations but all are magnificent. The Enlightenment Room is dedicated to those discoveries, artworks, and writings from the 18th century. The Age of Enlightenment was one of reason and learning, and Europe and America flourished with a bevy of new art and scientific discoveries. This room displays objects that reveal how scholars, artists, and writers understood and classified their world around them. A stroll through the British Museum is a stroll through the history of the human race. Understanding where we come from and how we got to where we are is one of the best ways to keep moving forward.